Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So for today, I thought it would be quite fun to maybe start a little bit of a series. It's been a while since I did a Rags to Riches series. Well, I, th I don't think I ever have. Most of the Rags to Riches storylines I've done have been either standalone videos or like a two or three parter. But I thought, you know what? Why not go all in? Let's start a series. So I've got my Sim here, her name is Alyssa. She has just moved into, I think this is the biggest ranch in Chestnut Ridge. As you can see though from the empty field and the bank balance, we're pretty broke as shit. We have nothing, no money, no home, no throne to sit on to take a dump, nothing. But Alyssa's got pretty big dreams, pretty big dreams of owning her own ranch. So we're starting from scratch. We're not gonna rush through this one. Sometimes I feel like when I do Let's Plays, well, half the reason why I don't do long Let's Plays is because I'm too focused on the goal, you know? Sometimes speeding through or rushing through gameplay to get to the end goal, I can admit that. But we're not gonna do that this time. We're just gonna take our time. We're gonna enjoy this experience, enjoy building a ranch from scratch. Now, obviously our priorities for episode one is to try and make enough money to at least give us like the bare basics, you know, cause we don't even have a house. So I think that has to come first. Now I have noticed, I think we kind of lucked out here that this lot has got wild prairie grass. So I think first things first, let's go and harvest that because that will bring in at least a few couple simoleons while we try and figure out how we're gonna raise the money. I don't think we're going to be in a position anytime soon to buy a horse, but possibly either in this episode or the next episode, I think we'll probably, once we've got our basic needs sorted out, I think we might be able to rescue a horse. I've never rescued a horse in this game before, so I don't really know what to expect. I'm guessing when you rescue one, all that it means is that you get a horse that's got maybe some bad traits, like a bad temper or something. So we might have to put a little bit more love into taking care of our horse than we probably would have if we'd bought a new one. Fuck off, welcome wagon. Look, look at the state of this place. I am in no way ready to host. Oh, actually, you know what? That was, that was a bad idea, because I could do with some friends. Oh shit, that was a really stupid idea. I'm gonna see if I can catch those people up. Hey guys, I changed my mind. I would like to be friends. Oh shit, first bad decision of the day. I could have done with having some some towny friends because then they would be able to like donate to me when I when I hold my little ranch event. What about this guy if I come say hello to him? Come on, don't, don't stay mad. Also, maybe I should look for some frogs. That could be the start of my ranch, unless it's worth a lot of money and then I'll just sell it. Well, that was uh, cancelling the welcome wagon. It just comes so natural to me. That was my first bad decision of the day. Never mind, Alyssa. We won't dwell. All my neighbors, look, they all fucking hate me now. Oh. Hey, Umber, Suli Suli. Sorry for, uh, for snubbing you back there. I was just, you know, getting a little bit overwhelmed with my situation. I'm sure you can understand. Right, I'm just gonna do a few small talk interactions, you know, just a little chit chat. Talk about the sunny weather, why not? Maybe, uh, share photos. Wait, where are you going? Hold up, hold up, hold up. That's one less sim that I want to be angry at me. And who knows? He could be the one. Oh, I got a surfer eggplant frog. He's romantic! <gasps> oh, okay. Okay, we're starting to go into the green now. I think we're all good with Umber. Needs are still good. Let's see how much... Oh, 24 simoleons for that grass. How much is the frog worth? Only 30. I may as well keep it. It's a rare one as well. Okay. Well, I do have an idea. I'm probably going to resort to the same shit I always do when I need to pull money out of my asshole. We're going to go to the dumps. The dumps over at Evergreen Harbour. See if we can find anything of value in there. Just to get us on our feet, you know? Just to, so that we could get a shower or a toilet or a bed or, you know, something. Die for deals. Don't you worry, Alyssa, I got your back. I'll keep an eye out, make sure that no dickheads come over trying to sift through our trash. Like this guy, Knox. Oh no, I don't have just go away. Uh, just go away uh, isn't popping up. Oh, for fuck's sake. How can I send him away? Oh no, you are not jumping the queue, Silver Sweater. You're not fucking jumping this queue. Go away. I don't want to chit chat with you, you fucking perv. Walk away. Oh, I found a, a desk. Okay, that's good. Teen writing desk. That's gonna be worth at least a couple hundred, I think. 
I mean, startup funds, really, we're, we're looking in the thousands to build, like, the walls and the, the rooms. The dumpster is empty. Well, if it's empty, why is he able to get in it? All right, we're going to go hop from one dumpster to the other. We're just going to go to all three dumpsters in Evergreen Harbour, and then we'll, we'll see what we can do. This dumpster is empty. Okay. Well, I'm not going to hang around. I'm not going to dilly-daddle. We'll just go to the third location and see if we have any luck there. Oh, this dumpster is empty too. Okay, I'm just going to take a nap in it. If I sleep in the dumpster, then everyone will know that I have dibs. I have shotgunned this dumpster for myself. Good way to catch up on my beauty sleep as well. Why are you knocking around in there? What are you doing? Okay, dive for deals. Dive for those deals. I know it's gross, I'm sorry. Found a bed! Oh, okay, okay. Beds are so expensive in this game, I might not even bother selling that. I might just keep that for myself. Okay, let's uh, wander back down to the quarry building then and see if the dumpster's been refilled yet. No, still empty. Well, you know what? We're going to nap in that dumpster as well then. She's got all kinds of disgusting mood buffs. Our needs are getting a little bit empty and I don't know that we've really collected enough to buy everything we need, but I guess we'll see. Oh, I found a toilet. Too cool for number two. That's a good toilet as well. What a successful haul, Alyssa. We found a few simoleons. God, what a successful day one this has been. Right, she needs the bathroom, but we do have, we, we did get a toilet, so we're going to go back to our ranch and we're going to test out our new throne. The only thing is, the stuff you find in dumpsters is always covered in shit, and usually you have to, like, replace it or, like, do something to make it look better, and I don't really have the money to be doing all that. But, you know, we'll see what we have. We have a plant, a toilet... Yeah, I don't really know how I would feel about sitting on that toilet. Oh, this bed is worth 3,700. I could get a bed for much cheaper than that. Okay, so you know what? I think I am going to sell the bed. Let's just try and buy the basics, replace what we've got as we go along. So we do need a bed. We don't necessarily need a double bed right now. Gotta be smart with this. What if I get this rancher's rest bed? You know, something like that. Well, this toilet is cu is currently worth 300, but it's this one here, which is 610. I mean, how can I, what are my options here? I could replace it for 300, so I'm getting like, I'm getting a 600 simoleon toilet, like 600 simoleon value toilet for the price of 305, or I could just repair it myself, which I might try and do. I've got time. Also need a shower. Just something basic like that. And I also need a fridge. Can I afford a stove as well? Yes, I can afford a stove as well. Okay, so let's just see what we're working with here. Let's see if we can build some kind of, I don't know, some kind of shell of a home. I have insufficient funds to build a room. Let me just take a look. This sofa... Oh, why does it say sell for zero? Okay, well, my dirty stuff I can't sell for anything. But, I mean, fine, fine. I guess we'll just live in the wild for a little bit. Who needs privacy anyway? Not me. We've got our lovely little, little seating area here, little living space, kitchen area. I mean, this is a desk, but, you know, we could use it as a dining table without a chair. And a bed right here next to the John. Okay, successful day. I think we better start off by repairing that toilet. Oh, and she desperately needs to go as well. Okay, you might have to shit your pants only once, Alyssa, just today. And then once you once you repair the toilet, then you can you can sit on the throne any time, any day. But at least we have the things we need to take care of our basic needs now. You know, and that's the main thing. Dislikes handiness. I'm gonna say no because I feel like you know running a farm. You better clean that. Running a farm slash ranch, you're probably going to have to get used to being handy around the house. Oh, and this place is going to end up smelling awful because I didn't buy a trash can either. Ah, uh, well. At least we've got our frog. There we go. Now you can enjoy your toilet. You could take a nice shower. I don't have anything for your fun, but you could just play a game on your phone. Take a shower. Why aren't you staying in the shower? What's your... Okay. That's right, enjoy your shower. I think for right now, we can only really have a quick meal, um, like a sandwich maybe. 
Look at those needs all turning green. And you even found a little friend to socialise with. Oh, is that left over from our welcome wagon? Oh, grab a plate, girl. We'll introduce ourselves to this chick, why not? When you're in desperate situations, it's always good to have a few friends. What's the, how's, how does that song go? I get by with a little help from my friends. Plus, it's good to have some names on the contact list for when we need to borrow some money. Discuss interests. And then I need to find something fun for you to do, so I'm just going to have you play a game on your phone. Entertain yourself for a few hours. There we go, you're having fun. I don't understand, though, why Sims... They have like a set time limit for how long they play a game. I don't understand why you wouldn't just play a game until you're starting to have fun. Oh, I can name my ranch. Oh, I'm going to wait until I can think of like, when my ranch gets a bit more established, then I'll think of a name for it. Get a few hours of sleep. Oh, today is rebate day. I could have done with that before. Could have done with rebate days yesterday. I wonder if there are any community jobs I could do that don't require me to have a horse. I mean, if I was in Sulani, there would be, but... Today's... Oh, bills have just been delivered. Yeah, I need that, like a fucking hole in the bollock. Um, let's see. Community jobs. Okay, so I have no horse riding skill, but what I understand from this is that the minimum I could earn is 95... Oh, 95 simoleons in four hours, though. Hardly seems worth it. I mean, I could make more if I just dumpster dive again, couldn't I? It's, it's hard to make a living, you know, when you don't have many skills. I've got a little bit of comedy. You're a bit hungry, so maybe we'll just have a super quick meal. Just like, just a little bowl of cereal. What should we do? I think, let's go dumpster diving again, because we might get a good haul like we did yesterday. I just really need to furnish my house. Oh, you look nice today. Got all dressed up to swim around in trash. Fuck off, fires. Moira. Oh, you fucking slag. That trash can is full as well. Get out of it. I literally stand inside of you if it makes you leave. Oh, she's still... Look at that. She's taken half of the stuff. Oh, can I just... Can I just kill her? Uh, reset object. There we go. She's back for more. She's standing there watching me as if she hadn't just taken half the fucking goods in this can. You and me are gonna fall out, Moira. The dumpster is empty, I barely got anything. Oh, right, okay, let's go to the next one. If I see you there, Moira, you and I are gonna have a scrap. And I will tell you that for free. Okay, quarry building, let's see. Dumpster is empty, go and take a nap in it. We're gonna shotgun this dumpster before any other fucker comes along, thinking they can interfere with my let's play. All right, wake up. It looks like there's maybe potentially some deals in there we could we could get our hands on. Five simoleons, okay, fuck off, ladies. Caliente, I've seen the size of your house. Get out of it. Oh, I did find some flowers though, so I suppose there's that. That's quite nice. A slob, no, we don't wanna be a slob. I reject that, reject that personality discovery. Okay, I think that, that trash can is empty now. Well, that was pretty unsuccessful. I think we should go home. I mean, I got these upgrade parts and just a vase. Great. Well, I'm gonna sell the vase just because it will at least help me finish building this room. There we go. I'll just get a very basic door for now. Is decking free? I'm pretty sure decking is free, isn't it? Yeah, zero simoleons. All right, well, that's something at least. Can I afford windows? Yeah, I think I can afford a couple. I'm just gonna have to be a bit sparing. What about flooring? Can we can we splash out and get some flooring? No. All right, well, lighting then. At least we can take a more dignified shit inside without ever washing our hands. Got the little kitchen over here. Okay, well that's not bad, is it? That's not, that's not too bad. Trash can? Okay, we'll put a trash can by the front door. And then I can stick my rubbish in there, my bowl. Okay, we've we've got we got something at least. Take a shower. I mean, I suppose beggars can't be choosers. I may as well do the community job. I'm gonna get the the worst payout if I even get paid at all because I haven't even acquired the horse riding skill. But you know what? Let's just try it. Let's see what happens. At least it's like some money if I get paid. You know, better than nothing. Started training a neighbor's horse. 138 simoleons. Well, that is that is not bad going at all, is it? It's a stepping stone. It's something. Go and have a sandwich. 
go and take a shit. What else do we need to do? Have fun. Okay. And we've now acquired the horse riding skill. Maybe we should do that job every day because... Why are you just standing there? Alyssa. Yeah, if we do that job every day, not only will we get some money from it, but why are you just standing there? Can you go? I've just reset you. But we can also build up our horse riding skill without paying out to buy a horse. What the fuck is wrong with you? Why are you doing this to me? What about if I teleport you onto your own lot? Why? Are you just, are you just broken? Well, I guess this is just our life now. We're just going to stand here forever. So I guess that seriously is what we're going to do. Oh, why? She's going to have bladder failure in a minute. Is Vlad broken as well? Is everything just broken now? Okay, is there a way I can fix this without having to restart? What about if I modify you and then go back in? Finally, she listens. You only have yourself to blame for that, Alyssa. You only have yourself to blame. Go and get a sandwich. Take a shower. You stupid bitch. And then I think I'm going to send you to bed. Oh no. We need to pay our bills. Shit. Man, this starting from scratch is it's not easy. Don't even know where my mailbox is to even... Oh, here it is. I d obviously, I can't afford my bills. Oh, they're not that crazy right now. 243. If I did one more job, then I can get my power back on. I know you want to have fun, okay? But life can't just be fun. This is the dismal reality that we live in, unfortunately. Alyssa, go and do a community job. Missing horses. Well, if you pull your finger out, you're right. very glamorous. You're getting really dress dressed up for the shitty life that you have, Alyssa. If you want a horse so badly, then you're going to have to work. Priority number one is paying the bills. Okay, we should have enough now. Only just. Only just enough to cover our bills. Okay, we are going to... We're going to go to the pub and see if we can try and have a better day. We'll try and get you to have some fun. Let's go to the oak barrel. We'll try and have some fun. Try and cheer you up a little bit. It's not all doom and gloom. Might feel like that right now, but it isn't. Right, what can we do that's fun? Can we dance? I mean, we can listen to classical. I'd quite like to dance, though. Really, I came to the wrong place, didn't I? Yeah, I came to the wrong place. I meant to go to, like, the nightclub. Let's go there instead. Because then you can dance and have some fun. And then if you dance, you can talk to other people. You can build up your social as well. Get to know the locals. Happy days. Well, she seems to be making friends. And I know we're quite poor, but I think, you know, everyone deserves a little treat every once and again, every once in a while. So I think we can splash out and get some french fries. And then we'll pop to the loo. And then we'll see what, what else we can do to make some money. I mean, there isn't really much, is there, that we can... When you're unskilled, you know, if we were like a talented musician or something, we could maybe earn some tips, but... Wait, where's the bathroom in here? Oh, here it is. Not leaving my french fries behind for these freeloaders to try and pinch some chips off me. No fucking way. I'm gonna grab another serving while I'm sat on the toilet. <laughs> oh, she's gonna take a nap. Okay, fine. Oh, now she's energized. Right, what can we do? I think let's go dumpster diving one more time. Nancy Landgrab, if you think you're getting your mitts on that dumpster, you can think again. I'm just gonna reset you, bitch. I will reset you again and again. Whatever it takes. There is no way a woman with the amount of Botox that you have needs to be here right now dumpster diving. You didn't get that tit job from, ruffli from ruffling through filth. We both know that, Nancy. Walk away. It looks like this bin is quite full, actually. So I'm really hoping we get a good haul today. Oh, I got a really cute bathroom heart-shaped shelf. I'm gonna keep that. Moira, evening. Oh, we've cleared it out. We've emptied it out. We didn't really get much. A little bit of dye and that's it. Some loose change. Ah, oh, hard life. This bin's gonna be empty, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, let's just go home then. Do you know what I might do? What I might do that could help? So it's currently summer. If I buy some seeds, some vegetables, some fruits, can't really afford much else. Oh wait, the shelf is worth 1,455. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna have to sell it. I thought it was so cute, but I'm, just, I'm gonna have to sell it. Now let me just, let me just plan something. See, if I put these seeds in my inventory, open them up, because half the issue I find with gardening is that things go out of season so quickly, but I could go into my game options and then just extend the season so that we have summer for ages, and then I'll just sell everything I have 
that isn't suitable for summer. Mm, 28 days might be a bit much. Let's go for 14. Two weeks of summer. And that way, everything that I plant is like guaranteed to bring in some kind of income. Okay, so now I just have... I've got my summer fruits, my plantain and my bell peppers, so I can grow them now. I've kept my grapes because I plan, you know, a little bit further down the line, I plan on dabbling in winemaking a little bit. So when I can afford to build a greenhouse, then I'll plant my grapes. But until then, I'll just keep them cozy in my inventory. I might just let her fill her needs and then we'll see what we can do to the house. I may as well replace this sofa because I think it's probably going to be worth a bit more than 550. And now we can sit on it and we'll just have a quick meal, quick sandwich. This poor Sim living off of sandwiches. Oh wait, no, you had food. Oh, you had food in your inventory. Oh well. And then you can go to sleep. Could replace this table as well. I'm not going to bother replacing the desk just yet because I don't really need it. But I'm thinking, let's just, f let's make her kind of happy and then we'll see what we can do. All right, energy's in the green, get outside. Okay, so we've paid our bills. We don't need to worry about that. I don't have anything else to sell. I would like to get a horse, like rescue a horse. But maybe, maybe let's try and make this house feel just a little bit more like a home. Perhaps if we just stick some stairs outside. We don't necessarily need to worry about fencing or anything just yet. Let's just make it accessible. I think we can definitely treat ourselves to some flooring, even if it's just basic. Something like this, you know, rustic. Stick some decking out front as well, I think. And the indoor for now, you know, it really doesn't need to be anything fancy because we're going to build on this house quite a lot. So let's just start with, you know, just a plain, maybe green. Yeah, we just need a plain wall colour. I don't think I'm going to bother with a roof, which sounds a bit silly, but it's only because, like, this is going to eventually end up being like a proper nice farmhouse, like mansion type thing. So it's going to have a, a upper floor, so kind of hesitant to really do anything too drastic, you know? So we're not really looking for like the final look right now. We're literally just making it feel a little less plain plaster wall. All right, that will do for now. That will do for the house. Is there anything else I actually like really need? I suppose I could do with a TV, but that's not really... Oh, I need a sink actually and counters. Those are pretty urgent. So I've got a counter for my cooking, a sink here. We can't really afford a fire alarm, so we're going to have to forego safety. But that doesn't leave me with anything. So I think to rescue a horse is about 250. To feed one, okay, it's only 50 simoleons for an animal feeder. How much is a bed? Another, so I only need like 350 simoleons to get my foot in the door with getting a horse. Hmm, okay. Well, first things first, let's just plant some of these peppers. I've put my trees over there, because I'm kind of thinking, you know, the middle over here would be quite a cute little, little mini garden area. I'm thinking I could get a cute little fence, have it like the center, just a little, little garden area. I think that would be quite sweet. They're only bell peppers, but you've got to start somewhere. And then we will water all of them, and then we'll go and plant all of our little trees over here. Yeah, and when this place is up and running and we have loads of money, we'll be able to hire so many members of staff. We could have a gardener, a ranch hand. I don't really know what else. Maid, maybe, just to keep things in check. And then when we eventually get into autumn, we'll have a bit more money. We could, um, we could grow a little pumpkin patch. Oh, we could grow a little pumpkin patch and then invite all of the little community kids to come over and pick a pumpkin. How cute would that be? And then their parents would pay for them for above the going rate. All right, well, that's all my planting done. Oh, I better water all of these actually. So far, we have not done too badly, have we? We've got a roof over our head at least. So, you know, place to live. We've started investing our time in growing some fruit and veg which I'm sure will be grown probably by tomorrow or the day after. I'm going to go on one more community job and then I think this would be a good place to end the first episode and I'm hoping that in the next episode we will finally get ourselves a horse. Oh, you know what also I can do? Oh, how are her needs doing? She needs the bathroom. I'll send her to the bathroom when she gets in but also I realise we have all this prairie grass as well. So we'll harvest all of that 
and hopefully that will bring in a little bit of extra money too. Oh no, she had another accident. Oh dear. Oh, her first bottle of strawberry nectar. We should get drunk and, f and forget all about our problems. How much is that bottle worth? 2,520. Oh, shut up. Nine lots of prairie grass hay. Fucking hell, that bottle of wine is a gold mine. And my bell peppers are already starting to grow. Right, I'm gonna end it here. I'm gonna end it on a high and then in the next episode, I'm gonna sell that bottle of nectar and I'm gonna get myself a horse. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.